Hi, I'm Oz Noy. In this video, I want to show you a couple of concepts that I've been using that are really helpful to me and probably to you too to be able to develop some new musical ideas or just to expand your vocabulary. None of this has to do anything with a style of music. It's really based on just music, it's meaning scales and chords. In our case, it's going to be one chord and a bunch of scales that I'm going to show that I'm using. And the bottom line of all of this is a lot of musicians that we hear that their playing sounds pretty complicated. It's actually not as complicated as, as you think it is if you know where it's coming from and if you got the right tools to use to get there. So what I'm going to try to do is I'm going to give you pretty basic tools that with a little bit of uh, thought and exercises and, and direction you'll be able to take it to the next level and keep developing and developing and developing it. I think um, in my plan and in other people's plan that we all love, um, it actually really is much easier than it end up sounding at the end. It's just a matter of you knowing where it came from and how to get there. So in this video, I'm going to just try to help you get there. Before we get into it, I want to talk about two concepts that are really important to me that will kind of glue everything together for you once we start really getting into the scales and the chords. The first thing that's really, really important is, um, is the chord concept. Now, the idea is this. There's only three chords in the world. There's a major chord, dominant chord, and a minor chord. That's all we have. And this is what we have to improvise over. So if we're talking about a major chord, it could be anything with a major third in it, which means that, and, and, and a major seventh in it, as, as long as the seven is not flat, which means like C major, C major six, C major seven, C major seven sharp five, C major seven four, anything that has a major three, and, a, and doesn't have a dominant flat 7 is a major chord. So that's the first option. Now the second option 